Hey, Miss Shanna, you're watching Night Lights, a show about what to do and where to go in your area. I'm your host, Amy Beers. Tonight, we will be hanging out in South Bend. First stop, AJ's Burger Shack and Pub. Not only do they have great burgers, but they also have amazing, yummy pizza. Then we're going to head on over to Moon Dogs for the Halloween party. I'm going to change into my fairy costume and compete in their costume contest. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Welcome back. We're hanging out at AJ's Burger Shack and Pub in South Bend. Tonight is Thursday night trivia night with AJ from U93. Not only does AJ's have great burgers, but they also have really yummy, amazing pizza. We're going to go in and talk to Grant and make a yummy, meaty pizza. And we'll also be talking with Kimberly, who's going to make us the dingbat. Let's go in and check it out. What kind of drink specials do you have? Tonight we have a pitcher of butt or pitcher domestic with 10 wings for $13.75. We have 32-ounce domestics for $3 as well on Thursdays for trivia. Mondays are 16-ounce um, and 22-ounce domestics are $2 and $2.50. Fridays, we have pinnacle martinis, anything pinnacle, all different flavors for $5. We have new specials for football. We have 32-ounce for $4. We have a pitchers of domestic with 10 wings for $13.95. I think 15 wings in a pitcher for $15.95. And a pitcher of soda with a flatbread pizza for $9.95. So that's on Saturday and Sundays for football now. I like how you combine the drink and the food specials. Yes, it's nice because people just want to sit and chill and munch and drink, and it's better that way. Do you guys have any specialty drinks? I do have a specialty drink. What is it? I um, invented it. It's called, the, it's called the Dingbat <laughs> because I'm pretty dingy. What's in it? It is pineapple juice with... Pinnacle Mango and Raspberry Absolute. That sounds tasty. Splash of Cranberry. Splash of Cranberry. Even better. I can make you one. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Get a tall glass, because I only make them in tall glasses. Yeah, that's perfect. That's like a tropical, tropical fruits, tropical themed bar. This is the Pinnacle, the one that you have not seen yet. I'm going to use the mango. Pinnacle Mango, one shot. Drop that in. Then I'm going to use Raspberry Absolute. I like Absolute. See, I've heard of that. Yes. Absolute is good. Ooh, and we finished it. Oh, nice. You can just go ahead and dump the rest of them. <laughs> <laughs> then we do the pineapple juice with a splash of cranberry. Voila. There we go. The dingbat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If I drink this, does that mean I'm a dingbat? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, so yes. No, it's not. I, it happened on accident. A girl I thought made this, and when they asked me what it was called, I said the dingbat because she was kind of dingy. Well, then it turns out that it was nothing like her drink. So I'm like, well, I guess I'm the dingbat. So there's the name. <laughs> it's pretty good. What does it taste like? It tastes like something. I don't know. I don't know, but it's good. Good. I'm glad you like it. Thank you. Have you heard of Bartender of the Month contest? I have not. It's through the Michiana, Michiana Entertainer magazine. You get, a, get as many people as you can to vote for you. Refer to the information below if you want to vote for Kimberly. But you get people to vote for you, and if you make it, you win prizes. If you win Bartender of the Month, then that qualifies you for Bartender of the Year. And then if you win Bartender of the Year, you get even more prizes. Oh, cool. I like that. So, again, if you want to vote for Kimberly, refer to the information below. Thank you. We're going to go in and see what the kitchen is up to. I'm going to see if I can make it through these swinging doors. Ready? Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> well, what are you guys hungry for? I'll make you guys a pizza. My favorite pizza is anything with a lot of meat on it. Do you guys do that? I can do that. You can? Yeah. Next to burgers, AJ's is really famous for their pizzas. How many pizzas do you guys go through a night? Um, probably about 15 to 20 of them on a good night. And then um, probably about another 20 flatbreads for lunchtime. What's flatbread bread pizza? That are these little crusts right here. How is that different from a regular crust? That is actually just put on just a regular old piece of uh, baked flatbread versus our 14-inch crust that we use for uh, dinner time and stuff. We start out with kind of a base sauce and then add our own little blend of ingredients to it. We are actually expanding 
our restaurant. So when that gets done, we will be able to uh, have the space to make our own dough. So we're going to do that too. Can I sprinkle it on now? Any other favorite sausage? Sausage, pepperoni. Give me all the meat you can find. All the meat? All right. All of the meat. Especially the sausage. It's got to be spicy and hot. I got to sweat. It's got to be so spicy hot that I sweat. Do you do your own sausage? Yes. When we do the pepperonis, can I make a pepperoni face? Sure can. We'll do that next. Are these homemade chips? Yeah, yep. We just started doing our own homemade chips now. These are our hot ham and Swisses on pretzel buns. You've gone through maybe five pieces of it since I've been back here. Yeah, we went through about six or seven more before you got here. So it's kind of just the start of the night, yeah. Wow, it's still early. It was only like 7 o'clock. Yeah, this will go on until about 11.30ish probably. What time do you guys stop serving food? Uh, usually 11.30. So, uh, that's, pretty, that's pretty late. I think most places are 11, maybe 10. I think when we have the new, when we do get the new place, we're going to expand and uh, expand our kitchen hours a little bit. So. That's nice. It's one of our busiest nights. Yeah, people come out. We run uh, a lot of different beer specials. 32 ounces for like 325 of uh, import. We run a pizza and or uh, wings with a pitcher of beer for a certain price, and and uh, really fly through our hot wings too. That's another thing that we go through about uh, four cases of hot wings a week, which is a lot, yeah. close to 500 wings. Do you go through the most wings on trivia night? Is trivia night a pretty popular night? Yes. Um, generally from 6 o'clock on, you can't find a seat in here. So <laughs> it keeps us hopping. It really does. <laughs> it looks like a clown now. <laughs> All right. And we'll cook it up, and I'll let you know when you guys are ready for dinner. All right. This is the place to go on Thursday nights. Yeah. Trivia night? Trivia night. Are you guys doing the trivia? Not tonight. Some of the guys have to go home early, so. What time does trivia end? Uh, was it like around nine? I think it's around nine o'clock. When does it start? It starts at seven. Seven to nine trivia. I think you guys should get up on the table and go surfing. <laughs> get up and surf on the table. Beers <laughs> yet? Kicked out here. We like coming here on Thursday nights. <laughs> they might not like that. They might not like that at all. You guys are like the surfboard people. Are you doing the trivia? Yeah. How does that work? Can I grab this? Can I take this? Round one and round two? Yep. How does this work? Just fill out the answer that you think, and you got the points there. Are you guys having fun? Sure. Always a good time. Yeah. Why is it so fun? Because Troy's paying. <laughs> Who's Troy? Which one's Troy? Uh, the leprechaun. <laughs> So what? What brings you out tonight? They didn't have any fun without me, and they were like, well, you know, we really need to have some fun. I was like, well, I could sacrifice a Thursday night. So they don't believe that my last name is really Beers, so I'm going to go grab my ID because they don't believe me. Bam, there it is. Amy Beers. I'm sorry. That is so awesome. I know, isn't that crazy? It's so fitting that I do this job. Do you actually drink beer, though? I do. Nice. Once again, my pizza face got all messed up. It's okay, though. It's just going to go in my tummy. Doesn't really matter. I eat my pizza European style. Is that weird? It's good. It's good. I don't think I've ever had bacon on my pizza. It's really good. It's good. If you've never tried bacon on your pizza, you try it. It's pretty good. Dave has ordered an ostrich burger. Is it actually ostrich? I I would assume so. I'm gonna see you try it. Try it and tell us tell us how it is. I've actually never had one before, so really? yeah. Very good. Is it? Mm -hmm. What does it taste like? It's like a lean uh, hamburger, really. Yeah. yeah. Good. Yeah. yeah. What'd you get on it? I saw some like cheese and some peppers. Olives and uh, onions. I think that's good. Yeah. Nice. This is your guys' first time at AJ's, right? Yes. It is. What do you think so far? I like it a lot. There's a lot of people here. It's pretty happening.